I'm Bobby Ryan for FCDallas.com, here to preview FC Dallas versus the LA Galaxy. The last time out for the LA Galaxy was a 3-0 home win at the Home Depot Center over the Portland Timbers. They rolled out a 4-4-2 formation. These were the players that fulfilled that formation. Local man Omar Gonzalez starts at the right center back for the Galaxy. David Beckham plays in the center of midfield for them. Landon Donovan lines up on the right side of midfield. So really look for all of those players to try to combine in the center of midfield as they move forward. For the FC Dallas you see here, a 4-1-4-1 formation. Last time was at the Vancouver Whitecaps, a thrilling 2-1 come from behind victory in that match. Obviously we know the loss of David Ferreira. So this was the team that did come out last time. Breck Shea started on the left side of midfield for FC Dallas. Fabian Castillo started up top in that formation. I believe for FC Dallas to have success against the LA Galaxy at Pizza Park on Sunday will be for the back four of FC Dallas to keep a good shape. And I would say that about any team in Major League Soccer. But what you'll see for the LA Galaxy when they took on the Portland Timbers last week, it was the Galaxy possession through McGee, Janino, Beckham, and Donovan that was so good and early on in that match. And so what you'll see in the clip is some combination play between, between Janino, David Beckham, Lane and Donovan is the man that plays Chad Barrett through on that sequence. And it is all created by the left center defender for Portland who comes a little bit out of positioning. He breaks the back four and ultimately it creates a gap for Chad Barrett to run through. And so it's a loss of that shape by the Portland Timbers defense that ultimately creates the opportunity. Now it's the LA Galaxy possession that really sets up all of that entire sequence there but really look for FC Dallas to try to maintain and keep their shape across the back four. We talked to George John about how important that would be. You know, I think we need to uh, keep communicating well and staying compact uh, in the back and not getting too aggressive on the flanks. You know, we have great outside backs and like to get up and down a lot, but we got to, Ugo and I have to do a good job of keeping at least three of us back there at all time and, you know, remaining solid. I believe the second key to success for FC Dallas on Sunday when they take on the LA Galaxy is they must look to contain Landon Donovan's pace. And I believe last week when you look at that Galaxy and Portland Timbers match, there were a couple opportunities that the Galaxy had that were created through that speed and pace of Landon Donovan. And it was really a loss of possession in the midfield by Portland that led to that counterattack. So FC Dallas will need to do a good job of keeping possession maintaining the ball in good areas of the field, and also always keeping an eye on where Landon Donovan is. We talked to Eric Avila about how important that will be. You know, it's very important for us to uh, maintain his speed. You know, he's a, he's a great player. Um, and, and I think our, our back line and, and our wing play is the, they're quick enough and, and fast enough that can stay with him. Um, you know, if we just keep them in front of us, in front of us I, mean, I think we'll be fine. Well, anytime the LA Galaxy come into town, the home team always has to be prepared for the quality service of David Beckham or Landon Donovan. That is the third key to success for FC Dallas on Sunday. So look for the center of defense, George John, Ugo Hemelu, perhaps, and Kevin Hartman, Daniel Hernandez, really sort of the leadership or the core of the FC Dallas team to lead the concentration and the focus and the commitment of all the players that will be required to defend such quality pinpoint service of those two players. We talked to Kevin Hartman about how important that would be. I think the most important thing for us is just to make sure that we, uh, we recognize the, the quality and the consistency that Landon and, and David bring. Um, and if we're aware of it and we're cognizant of it, then I think that we, do, we can do a good job of making sure that when, when they prepare the ball that we're really getting them under the pressure or maybe they have to turn around and, and uh, play the ball backwards and maybe not swing it into our box or at least make it a rush service, you know, not really give them the time to, to do all the stuff that they want to do. Will the LA Galaxy come to Frisco on Sunday seeking revenge for that 3-0 loss at the Home Depot Center in the Western Conference Final? You'll have to tune in to see that or attend the match at Pizza Hut Park. Kickoff is at 6 p.m. Central Time on TXA 21, or for our Spanish listeners, you can tune in at 1270 a.m. La Voz del Pueblo with your host, Carlos Alvarado. Well, this will be a packed house at Pizza Hut Park, and it is certainly a match that you do not want to miss. For FCDallas.com, I'm Bobby Ryan.